Pelletier, run the meeting. Okay. You, you voted and I vote. First. Put me in the chair. Second. All in favor? Aye. I'll take the chair. <laughs> Mr. Kadeem is running late, and I was voted to run the meeting on regulations for tonight. Okay. Uh, yeah. Pursuant to the old meeting law, any person may make an audio or video recording of this public meeting or may transmit this meeting throughout any any media attendees are therefore advised that such recording and transmission are being whether perceived or unperceived by those present and deemed acknowledgeable and permissible uh roll call council here council pelletier here chairman kadeem okay first on the item uh, citizen input anybody want to come down and speak Okay, uh, item number two, minutes of the meeting in uh, 219. Motion, motion to adopt. Motion to adopt. And second, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Number three, uh, Zach F. De Silva, Zach's Garage, renewable of an auto repair shop license located 65 Manchester Street, it was referred on 528. 219 and can we have Mr. De Silva here? All right, why don't you come down? And yeah, just take a seat there. And the fire department. And can you give us a little background on what's happening uh, with this license? Oh. Oh, let's get the names. Make sure we get the yeah. names. And your name, sir? My name is Eduardo Alves. Uh, we represent my father in law, Zeph the Silva. He's the owner of Zeph the Ranch. And your address? Located on 65 Manchester Street. Your address? Oh, my address is uh, 189 5th Street. 5th? Yeah, first floor. And? Paul Cody. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. The the license um, was up for renewal and was presented to the city council at the May twenty eighth um, city council meeting. It was referred to the committee on regulations due to the fact that it was. Um, denied by all three departments. It was denied by the fire department for numerous violations. It was denied by um, the chief of police for a non-renewable license and also denied by the city um, tax collector for um, taxes owed. And as of today, we still have not received anything that any of these issues have been rectified. The right. license did um, expire on June 25th. You visit this meeting for the garage? No? Yes. Oh, the police department. Okay. Mm -hmm. And your name for the record? Brian Kudero for Okay. Uh, tell us what's going on down there. At, uh, you got no, didn't, we didn't issue a license because they have problems. So what's the status now? We, we did an inspection on 5-9. And we found uh, multiple violations. Yeah. And we also found evidence of them doing body work. Okay. Uh, Takata's taped, paints. Paint. Yeah. Okay. This was taken a homemade heater that he made himself. <laughs> yeah. But that was already taken care of. We took care of that. Uh, 
So we told him what he needed and we did a reinspection on 520 and nothing was done. And except he had another car, different, taping it for some body work to be done. The language barrier was tough. He, it wasn't the owner, it was a worker. Yeah. We tried to explain to him as best we could. He gave me the owner on the phone and I told him and uh, that was the last that we, we've been down this. And, and okay. Mr. Um, I was asked to do a um, background check and uh, the owner's license is non-renewable which means he owes money to the state or the city. Okay. So as far as the police department is concerned, we're not going to do that. Okay. Okay, yeah, I wasn't aware of some of, some of the issues that was brought up. Uh, he thought, uh, I worked with him before, he's my father also, he asked me to come here because of the language barrier. And uh, he only, the only issue that he thought was, was supposed to be uh, fixed was the one that the fire department, fire department just, just mentioned, which was the, the body shop and painting of cars there, which is not allowed. He has a license for repair shop, not for, for body shop. And uh, he has been away from the business for a few weeks. And then one of his employees was painting when, when, they, when the inspection was done. And then when we guys went back there, there's still some painting uh, being done there. Uh, but uh, I don't believe he's aware of the tax issues and uh, the, other, the other issue that the lady mentioned. So uh, I really I don't know if, uh, what's the status and what you guys to do with it. Because he thought it was only the auto body issue, which he was, he was right. going to fix and just have yeah. to renew for every part shop. So right now, he has no license, right? It's expired. It's expired. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So does that mean he's going to start all over the process? If that's the council's will. Uh, does he know that he has to reapply? Yes. Yes, he does. All right. Uh, yes, so the... The shop is currently closed? Yes, it is, as it is right now, yeah. Well, um, you certainly can't operate that way. And uh, about the taxes and the license and all that stuff, is he going to get that all squared away? He's, he's going to have to. Uh, he's, actually, he's, he's thinking about like just passing on the, the, uh, the business to someone else, that someone is interested in buying the business. Uh, he was just interested in renewing the license so he could pass on the business like put the license on. Uh, but as it is right now, I believe he's going to have to do the, the whole process again. Or either if someone's buy their stuff there and reopen the business in a different name. So I'll, I'll, I'll report that to him. So yeah. Why he stands. Well, I, don't, I don't think he was aware of all the issues. Uh, yeah. That you guys well, there's a, there's a lot of issues there. Yeah. He's got to get them all caught up mm -hmm. and um, if he decides to sell the the new guy would have to come in and that's it but I, I, I think you probably still have the commitments of paying them taxes and right. everything else I would have to right. say right. get everything cleared before you sell it sure. if that's the intent and uh, we can't do much here tonight but right. uh, uh, table it until you decide what right. do you want to do. Understandable. Okay. A motion to the table. Motion to the table. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. That's it. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Go back to lunch. <laughs> okay. Uh, I will, I guess. Yep, yeah. take it. Uh, motion to, um, motion to adjourn. To adjourn. Second. All in favor? Aye.